Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? It's Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Super 7 video. This time we're talking about Every Super 7 Ultimates for the Transformers. So, Wave 1 of Transformers Ultimates was teased back on the 7 Days of Super 7. Where they teased all kinds of lines like the Thundercats, the Silverhawks, Star Trek The Next Generation, Power Rangers, and all kinds of goodies like that. And if you haven't already done so, get on over to Big Bad Toy Store, link in the description or in the card above. Get your pre-orders in for your Super 7 Ultimates. Transformers. Transformers is coming to Super 7 as Ultimates. So here was the tease with Starscream. So we're getting... These are a set of four figures for $220 or $55 each. You can go and pick those up or pre-order them right now. You have the Ghost of Starscream. Here's the slipcover. Here he is in package, or what he would look like in package. Three different heads, several hands, front, back, side. You have Optimus Prime with all kinds of accessories. Got a basketball, an axe, a surfboard, a matrix. Here's the slip cover and the regular package. And there's the front and back of those accessories. And then they showed off this image of Prime on his surfboard and explained to us why they gave us a surfboard. You can see this image here from the cartoon where they are surfing. And the same for the basketball. You see this scene from the show where they're playing some basketball and that is why he has the ball as well. Front and back side of Optimus himself. And Brian has released a test shot of Prime, and of course he doesn't have any color to him yet, but this is what the figure is going to look like, and I'll get some color images here soon as well, I guess. And then we have Bonsai Tron. Don't know about him, I've never heard of him. Here's a package slipcover. Our back side of the figure. And then we have Bombshell, one of the Insecticons. There's the package, the slipcover, from back side of the figure. So there's all four from Wave 1 loose. There's all four in package and their slipcovers. So I don't know why, but after they showed off Wave 1 and what we were going to have, they gave us a tease of what Wave 2 and Wave 3 were going to consist of. And of course, Wave 2 will be Megatron G1, Grimlock G1 Dino Mode, Bludgeon Pretenders Trax G1. And then Wave 3 will be Tarn from IDW, Megatron G2, Alligaton, Alligator Con G1, and Retgar G1 from the movie. So let's get into wave two here with what we already knew, and here's the reveals. Here's all four of them in figure form. Looking really good. Of course, they do not transform, they are just robots, or in Grimlock's case, dinosaur. So there's all four with all of their accessories, and why do they have some accessories? Because they are ultimates, and ultimates for Super 7 mean they come with all kinds of accessories. So first off, let's talk about Bludgeon. Here's Bludgeon. He's got that huge tank gauntlet on his arm. He's got extra helmet you can put on, another head sculpt, all kinds of katanas, and hand sculpts to switch out. So what do we think about this? I don't know. I'm not familiar with Bludgeon myself. Let me know in the comments what you guys think about Bludgeon. There he is in package. There's what the slip cover is going to look like over top. And of course, this is just a rendering of what he would look like in package. This is not an actual picture of it in package. So, not too bad. I like the way that they've done the animation on these slides here, especially. Next, we have our Dinobot Grimlock. And Grimlock, if you see here, comes with his waiter's outfit there. So, that's pretty cool. He also comes with a wheelie. So, 
but just like the Hasbro Grimlock, he's got a wheelie that's going to ride on his back. Got a fish, a crown. Uh, I'm not sure what that mind transfer thing is right there. I can't remember. And then extra hands and feet, it looks like. Or maybe just hands. I guess they're all just hands. So what do you think? You think the bib or the, uh, the serving tray and everything's a little too much? Or is that pretty cool? I'd like to see that. Here it is in package with the slip cover. So not too bad. I like the way that's going to look. Hopefully that'll actually fit in there. I'm sure they'll have to take the tail off and put it somewhere else in there. Next we have our leader of the Decepticons. We have Megatron here. He's got the energy cube, three different head sculpts, a couple little monsters there I guess. Got a bunch of different weapons, a sword, a gun, and his maces, and of course a couple of different hand sculpts as well. I love the fact that you can flip his chest plate down and see actual energon cubes in his chest. That's pretty cool. Here he is with the package and the slip cover. Looking really good. I like the way that uh, artwork looks on the front there, the slip cover especially. And again with that energon chest, that's really nice looking. And then lastly in this wave two we have our Trax figure. And Trax does come with blaster and that's pretty cool. And his tape set for him. Also like a little alien head, some kind of little tank, a blaster, different hand sculpts, and another little laser gun. So looking pretty good for tracks here. It's probably one of the smaller ones in this line. There's the package and the slip cover over top as well. Nice artwork. Not too bad. So there are your four figures for this wave two. What do you think? Is this better than Wave 1? I know having Grimlock and Megatron is actually making this Wave 2 look a lot better for me. So there's all four loose. And all four in package with their slip covers. And so we already talked about Wave 3 and the fact that we knew what was coming, so let's get into the actual figures. So the T's for Wave 3. What's this little video game here with a ninja on it? What is it? Well, there's the full wave. All four figures. That tease was from Retgar, so that's crazy. So Retgar has all these accessories. This little right up here if y'all want to pause it and read on it. There's this package and slipcover. All the accessories it comes with there, the shields as the wheels, the axe, the gun, the extra head sculpt there for army building. Multiple hands, like I said, the little video game he's got. And then you got your alligator con. Also comes with a battle taxi, the Septicon Tower. Optimus Prime arm with ion cannon and Optimus Prime head with light pipe and then a wire bundle. So y'all can read up on the rest of this right up here on him. He will be 11 inches long. You see the package and the slip cover here. There's your 11 inches. This was a great episode when the Constructicons took Prime apart, used him for scraps. So there's what all it comes with. Not a lot of accessories, but that's all you need with something that large. All right, then you got your G2 Megatron again with the big old right up here. I'll let y'all pause it and read if you want to. There's the package and slipcover. All those accessories, the swords, the guns, the bullets, the hands, the three different head sculpts, the cannons. That's what makes him ultimate. That gun up there says big stick on it. 
All right, and then we got IDW's Tarn. You can pause it here and read up on it. He does have that Decepticon logo in his hand there. There it is in package. Slip cover as well. So the one accessory that stands out here is he does come with a nickel figure and the nickel jetpack there also. And he's got one head sculpt with the mask on, one with it off, and he's got the cannon and also the different hands. So that is wave three. All four figures, all their accessories. All four loose. And all four in package with their slip covers. And here's all the waves loose so far. And here they're all in package. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave any kind of comments. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Hit that thumbs up and I will talk to you guys later. Hey guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.